New at five, one Waterloo area volunteer fundraised for her mom and others in the Alzheimer's community today. KWWL visited the event at the Jessup Golf and Country Club and has the story. It's surreal. Going into it, it's just very humbling to know how many people cared and how many people stepped up to help us. Battle for Betsy brought longtime family friends, committees, sponsors, and silent auction donators together, fundraising to find a cure for Alzheimer's. I can't help my mom right now, but she would want us to do whatever we can now to help future people. The longest day has helped Abby's family focus on something positive while battling the devastating disease. Last year she was able to be with us, but this year she is not able to be here. An University of Iowa graduate about to launch his pro career teed off the tournament to show his support. This is amazing. My mom texted me or called me on the phone about two weeks ago and asked me to do this, and um, I immediately said yes. His grandmother is Betsy's sister and also has Alzheimer's along with more than 66,000 other Iowans who are living with dementia today. This is, this is about them and helping them get one step closer to their cure too. 88 people played in the golf tournament, which was then followed by a 5K walk where participants were able to sign a loved one's name on a flag. Golf is a favorite pastime of Betsy's to play with her husband, Dan. It brings back a lot of good memories. We had a lot of good times Friday and Saturday nights out here with friends. Uh, and it's something I remember, and that's what I want to remember, is the good times, not the bad. She's my sweetheart. If Betsy could be here, Dan says she would tell everyone to... Have a good time. Such an amazing story. Abby has raised $22,000 before today's event and is still fundraising. To make a donation, go to kwwl.com, and we'll have the link to the Battle for Betsy fundraiser for you there. And in case you missed it, in Powashee County,